Hi, John Legadakis here of MakeMoneyOnlineWithJohn.com. What I want to share with you right now are some SEO strategies that I use to get my blog uh, getting lots of free traffic from Google and the other search engines. And this is one blog post that does really well for me. It's called How Does Twitter Work? I'll show you the stats if we okay you can see here the top post how does Twitter work we've got 62 views and I think that's just within one day so this this blog post does uh, very well uh, for me at the moment and the way I came across the keyword initially was I used uh, Market Samurai which is an excellent uh, tool software for keyword research as if you want to rank high in the search engines you got to do your keyword research and it doesn't take very long you know I, I just did a search for Twitter related keywords and this one came up it says uh, it's got a search engine traffic SEO traffic meaning the uh, maximum daily potential daily clicks that a number one rank site for this keyword term would, could, could get so I was told if I rank number one I'm going to get about 204 visits to my site. The SEO competition is 61,600 competing sites, which is not a lot. So I thought, okay, great. I could easily do a blog post about how to twist Twitter works. So I did. I just did, you know, a simple uh, blog post. It didn't take me long at all. Uh, and you can see it here. And, you know, there we go. Look, that's about maybe three, three fifty, three hundred and fifty words maybe something like that um, and so the important things that I do for SEO is so do the keyword research obviously you want the higher the traffic the better the less competing sites um, then you've got how does you want it, your keyword you want to make sure that you have it as in the title and this one worked really well just by itself sometimes you have to append or or you know add something towards the end because the keyword by itself as a title won't make much sense but in this case it does just how does Twitter work and then I've got it here you can see that I did it in bold as well in the first sentence I've put my keyword phrase and bolded it. Uh, even better is if you can have it as a as a link as well. Uh, so I've put Twitter as as my first link. So if your first link on the page can be your keyword term, that's fantastic. And I've tried to put it throughout the article, not too much, but you know naturally, you want to put it maybe once every 100 words. You want to put your keyword phrase. Let's see if we can spot it in here where we have it. Um, okay. I think the I think towards the end of the article I've got here, while this article has covered the basics of how Twitter works. Okay, so I've put it there again. Uh, I might not have it anywhere else in the article. Like I said, you want it to be natural. You don't want to just throw it in there somewhere out of context. Uh, but if you can get about once every 100 words is the best. Um, okay. It's the best way to do it. Alright, some other things I did for SEO. Let's have a look. I've put, if we go to... Um, okay, if you look at the URL itself of the blog post... It is johnlegadarkus.com. How do, how hyphen does hyphen Twitter work? And this is done automatically for me within WordPress. Whatever my uh, blog post title is, that's what my um, URL is going to be for that blog post. And this doesn't happen by default. You have to set that up. And the way you do it is in your WordPress dashboard. If you go down to the uh, where are we? Okay, you have to go to the settings section and into this area here, permalinks, and I've already opened it up. 
here's my permalink settings you see the default one is just the post number and you don't want to do that for SEO you want to pick this fifth option custom structure and you want to type this in here forward slash percentage post name percentage forward slash all right and all that means is basically whatever the post title is it's going to put that as your URL which is what you want so that happens like I said automatically now let's see what other SEO strategies we've used for this one now I don't have an image uh, but if you can put an image with and when you insert your image so let's go uh, this is the the post what it looks like when I'm editing when I'm creating it in WordPress now if you can add an image and if the image that you're uploading if you can have as the file name your keyword so the file name might be how hyphen does hyphen twitter hyphen work dot jpeg uh, and if you can upload that and then when you upload it if you can also um, put as the uh, the title of the image your keyword phrase that is that that is really good for SEO okay and obviously original pictures work better if you're just using someone else's image um, that's still good but if you've got an original image that's it that's even better because then you can even get your site appearing in Google images as well for you for um, for that keyword okay uh, some other SEO All right. what you want to do is for your tags you want to add your keyword definitely so how does Twitter work as a tag and just the the root word which is Twitter is really good and if I scroll down now I've got this plugin installed the all-in-one SEO pack and this is a very important uh, plugin for SEO and to uh, just to, to install that you simply go into your if you go back to the dashboard you just go into the plugin section into add new and you can do I'll just quickly show you click on add new come in here just do a search for all in one SEO pack okay and there it is there and it's already installed but if you don't have that installed that link will be clickable you go ahead and install that plugin and once you've installed it this is the uh, what it's going to look like after you've installed it you want to make sure it's enabled put your the title of your blog so mine's John Lagodakis hyphen make money online blog so I've got my main keyword phrase that I'm targeting for my blog in my title uh, some a description, some of my keywords. Okay. Um, now, what the SEO, all-in-one SEO pack does, you can see here by default, it's whenever it creates a new post for me, it's going to put the post title first as the title of the page, and then the blog title. And what that means is, if you go to, if you go to a blog post, and you can see up here in the uh, in the tab here. The title of this particular page of my blog is How Does Twitter Work? Pipe John Lagodakis Make Money Online Blog. And that's also important for SEO. So the all in one SEO pack does that automatically for us. When we so when you're creating a new post, you put your title, make sure you put the title there, um, your keyword which which should be the same as the title of your of the blog post itself. Okay, so you've got the keyword phrase then you put a description and try to get your keyword phrase again in there just like I've done here and then for your keywords you want to have your main keyword phrase and then maybe a root keyword like Twitter okay so that covers the basics now if you're doing those things uh, that I've just gone through in this video uh, you know if you've done your keyword research you know the keyword should get you traffic um, you know there's not a lot of competition there's people searching for it if, and then if you go and do these things you know they're very simple little things that you can do there's no reason why you shouldn't be ranking high in the search engine You're getting lots of free targeted traffic for that keyword now I hope this has uh, helped you out if it has and if you have any comments 
I encourage you to leave them below this video, I really appreciate it. And also wanted to let you know I've got a step-by-step -step video e-course on how to make money online fast. And you can get free instant access to that right now. All you need to do is go to makemoneyonlinewithjohn.com. That's makemoneyonlinewithjohn.com. I hope to see you there. Thanks for watching.